Hey guys, welcome back to Diecast Reviews. Today, I'll be doing a mini racer unboxing of some mini racer three packs that I've uh, compiled over the past few months. Um, really, I'd say from like March, maybe February on till now. Um, you've got a decent mix of cars on the road, cars two, cars three, um, three packs. So yeah, I mean, let's just get into it. I'm excited. Uh, so I guess we'll start with one of the older ones I have. Actually, the oldest one I have. It's a few years old, but I showed this off in a short um, a while ago. The Carlo Veloso Raul Seru Lightning McQueen 3-pack. Uh, so let's just open it up, and then I'll show the mini racers themselves. So, see, Lightning McQueen, we're going to see him a lot today. I think twice, actually. Well, WGP McQueen's going to be twice. We're going to see a couple different McQueen variations. Here's Carla Veloso. We'll see her later today. Um, but Raul Sarul, if I can get him out here. We will not see later today. So let's take a look at him. Mini racer Raul Sarul. It's pretty cool. Uh, I think the proportions are nicely done on him. I do like the World Grand Prix racers quite a bit, um, and I think the mini racers for the World Grand Prix racers are really nice as well. So there's Raul uh, McQueen. Nothing special here. He's pretty common. McQueen with racing wheels. And here's Carla. We'll see her later today as well. So there's the first three. Put them off to the side here. Uh, since we're on the Theme of World Grand Prix Racers. Let's get this three pack. This is a new three pack with Jeff Gravett here out of the package. This Carla just fell down. But here is Jeff, the new kind of character. There he is. Looks very nice. Um, I think I think they did a great job on him. Really like the expressions. Kind of like the expression on the die cast, but a little bit um Smiling instead of like growling or whatever. Uh, there's a 24 there on the side. All the details, yeah, looks very nice. Let's all did a really good job on the Jeff Gorbat Mini Racer, the newest World Grand Prix racer to add to our collection. Here's McQueen and Carla again. Yeah, Jeff looks very nice, so let's keep him there. As we head to the next three pack, uh, let's go with the older one as well. I think like from February or something. The Speed Demon 3-pack with the Speed Demon, obviously, and Salt Flat, what do they call them here, uh, Super Speed Mater. But here is Speed Demon, and here's Super Speed Mater. We've got the regular Road Trip McQueen here. See him a little later today as well, so nothing special with him. But here are kind of the two interesting pieces from the set here. Speed Demon, obviously a new character. I think they did a fine, fine job on him as well. They do a really good job on all these mini racers. They, I mean, they look almost exactly like the die cast just miniaturized, right? They get all the detail in there. It looks fantastic. So there's Speed Demon. I mean, the scaling looks a little bit weird there. I don't think the scaling is... Like that on the 155. Like, I, I think they're about the same size. Jeff looks a little bigger there, but it is what it is. Uh, here is Mater. Speed, super speed Mater, as they call him. Number 55 there. He looks great. Obviously, we've gotten a plastic version of him, but we haven't gotten a die cast version of him, but he does. He looks good. He looks great. Nice job there by Mattel as well. Um, let's head to another, I don't know, interesting, this is an interesting pack. Three, uh, different characters, right? And no variants of McQueen or Mater or whatever. And these are all three characters that you could have avoided buying and just gotten them all in this pack and gotten three new characters. Well, I mean, I guess you could have done that for a lot, but Mater, her Mac, and DJ were released before, I believe, with a McQueen, I think, or something like that. Um, that was Snot Rod, and then you could get this pack and just get them, plus the new Snot Rod. Without uh, making much sense there, so I just knock off a few cars. Well, I think it's Carla and McQueen. It's okay. Let me 
they're duplicates anyways, but whatever. That was a lot of rambling. But what I'm saying is that there was a pack that I believe was Mac and DJ and another car. And then they just swapped that car out for Snarod, uh, which is kind of lame, but whatever. Um, so if you did buy that pack, you would have two Max and DJs. But I'm going to assume they're going to do something similar with like Wingo and Boost. They're going to put Mac and Snarod in a pack and then Wingo and then, you know, maybe DJ and Snarod and then Boost or whatever. But here they are. Obviously, the sizing there is very interesting. DJ is much bigger than Mac. Uh, so is Snarod, actually. It looks very interesting sizing there, but... It is what it is. They look good. Uh, here's DJ. I think he looks the best out of the three, honestly. Yeah, I think he looks the best. But here's Snarod. He looks very nice as well. Snarod always looks nice, in my opinion. I really do like him. Probably my favorite tuner. Although Wingo is pretty cool as well. And here's Mac. Uh, I think he's a little small, but... It's okay. Nice smile there. For Mac. And the opening there exists. Right, you can see the opening there. It's, uh, where's my thing here? It's, you can put something through there. It's not like on some of the 155 scale where they cover it up. It exists. So I wonder if we could get, like, you know, a Mac hauler. A little mini racer hauler there. That'd be pretty cool. But unlikely, but with the opening there exists existing that does open up the possibility for something like that to happen uh here's another older pack the holly shuffle pack um this one i really like because it's a cars 2 pack and i feel like cars 2 is often overlooked in you know diecast releases and whatnot uh nowadays at least it's overlooked so this is always a always pretty cool to get some cars 2 characters so really don't mind this pack at all of course, another WGP McQueen. Um, the third one of the night, but there you go. You can go back there. Uh, aside from the World Grand Prix Racers, I think Cars 2 is a bit overlooked, even with the Spies. I think it's a little bit overlooked at times nowadays, so I never I never mind getting, you know, um, you know Holly, Shift Roll, or Finn McMissile, whatever, in the case as a single. Or as a mini racer, I think it's fine. You know, I think they should re-release their Finn McMissile mini racer. I think it's pretty cool. I know we're getting Professor Z. I think Grem and Acer, or maybe Grem and Professor Z. I think that's fine. Uh, I don't mind the Cars 2 stuff uh, nowadays. I think they're pretty overlooked. Like I said, the focus has really shifted, obviously, to Cars 3 and Cars 1. And Cars 2 gets left behind, so never mind when we get some Cars 2 stuff. Uh, that's a really nice version of Mater. Funny Car Mater. Great. One of the better versions of Mater from Cars 2, in my opinion. So, really nice to get him. Uh, very unique. And here's Holly Shiftwell always looks good so we've got some of the newest packs left uh let's go to a new pack but three mini racers that were released before flipped over buried a pedal and ryan inside laney i believe ryan inside laney was actually featured on a another mini racers unboxing i did a few years ago so he has been on one of the few mini racers that has appeared on this channel in multiple videos there he is I do like Ryan Inside Laney as a racer. Here's a, you know, he's a pretty cool next gen. Here's Flipped Over and Flipped Over and Buried a Pedal. The RPM and Intersection next gens. Obviously, they were in the two pa in the four pack. That was pretty rare, the next gen four pack. Um, I think I've only, f I've only found it once, and that was the time that I got it. So, it's a very rare four pack, but I think they've, they've all been re-released. You know, Buried a Pedal multiple times. I think you can... Seen him in the stores multiple times. J.D. McPillar as well. I think I have a couple of extras of him, actually, from a case I got. Um, Flipped Over has been re-released, but he's a little rare. Steve Slick LePage, I think, maybe the rarer one of the four. But you can definitely, they're out there. They're not as expensive as they once were. Because I remember those four packs at one point were going for like 100 bucks on eBay. Um, yeah, expensive when they first came out. So there's those two. Um, honestly, trying to save the best for last. I think I have done that. Here's a very cool two, um, three pack here. The B movie three pack, basically. Um, I think the B movie was one of the best episodes of Cars on the Road, and I think it provided us with a lot of new characters and variations. And it was a really good episode. 
Um, here are the two kind of main character variations that President Mater may be my favorite variation of Mater from Cars on the Road. Um, he is really cool, and um, Deputy McQueen may be my favorite variation of McQueen from Cars on the Road. So, really cool to get them here in this three pack. Obviously, the single of Deputy Hazard McQueen here has come out. Um, I haven't found it yet, but it is out there, so hopefully. Picking it up, going to be able to find it soon and do a review on them. We'll compare the Mini Racer to the die cast if I get them, which I hopefully will soon. And here's President Mater. The color change has come out. The die cast has not, but do expect the die cast to come out before the end of the year. He looks, he does look fantastic. Yeah. Mater in this color, he looks great. He's got the presidential seal there on the side. Yeah, really like this Mater. Here, and here is Ivy, kind of a metallic version of Ivy, but that's the one that they're releasing in the mini racers right now, but uh, she's been released before, so nothing too special there, but still pretty cool. Um, got two packs here left, so I just kind of threw one across it, but this is also another pretty cool one, the Road Rumblers three pack with Chiefdis and Road Rumbler McQueen and Mater. Obviously, Road Rumbler McQueen is, and Road Rumbler Mater actually, both are supposed to come on the 155, uh, scale soon. Chief just I don't believe has been announced yet, but again, we get the mini racer. I expect her to come out soon as well. She's really cool. Hope we get the uh, VW bugs that were with her um, in the short as well. But there's Chief Tis. Yeah, looks very nice. Move to the back here just because there's no space. And here is Road Rumbler McQueen. And Road Rumbler Mayor. Uh, Road Rumbler McQueen is another one of my favorite variations of McQueen. I think it just looks really cool. Uh, Road, Road, Road Rumbler Mayor is okay. Um, looks a bit Cars 2 almost. But uh, Road Rumbler McQueen looks very nice. I do like Road Rumbler McQueen a little more than Road Rumbler Mayor. But still, two very nice releases. And here is the kind of last pack of Cars 2 slash Cars Tune pack. I think this is very creative. Another pack that I like because of its uniqueness and, you know, Cars Tune, first time appearing in the mini line. So, really cool. Here is Dragon Lightning McQueen, and also from Tokyo Mater, which I think is one of the best, uh, if not the best, Mater Tall Tale short. Um, Mater Private Eye is pretty good as well, but we've never received die cast from that from Mattel, and I don't think we will in the mini line. But there is Dragon Lightning McQueen and Tokyo Mater. Very, very cool. Compare them to the uh, funny Carmator variation here in a second. And here's Suki, who I think is just a really cool mini racer to release. I mean, she's already small. Then you put her in the mini racer line. She's probably one of the smaller mini racers. I have Luigi here, just for comparison, quickly. He's smaller than her, but she's pretty small, too. Um, but, yeah, I think she's a pretty... Cool mini racer, maybe my favorite from the uh, whole unboxing here. Just, just really cool. So I'll be right back with this kind of all cleaned up, and I'll show you the Mater variations and McQueen variations we've gotten here because there have been a so lot. So here are the McQueen and Mater variants we got. Kind of funny, they're actually split 5-5, five, five, though the McQueen variants are quite more boring than the Mater variants. Um, I also got the World Grand Prix McQueen here. No, really nothing special there in the Road Trip McQueen there. Nothing special there either. Though the Deputy Hazard McQueen is very cool. We've got the Road Rumbler McQueen and Tokyo or Dragon McQueen, Dragon Lightning McQueen. Uh, very cool, kind of. I mean, unique. This one has not been released since what, like 2014, 15. Just now hitting stores. Just now hitting stores. That present uh, Mater, he has not been released yet. As a diecast Tokyo Mater again released last with Dragon McQueen like 2014 2015. World Rumbler Mater has not hit stores yet. Um, Super Speed Mater, as they call him, has not been released yet. And uh, Funny Car Mater has not been released since like 2012. So I think it was pretty rare when he was released in 2012 as well. So this is a really cool mini. But uh, yeah, quite a lot of different Mater and McQueen variations. And it's cool that, you know, it's not just regular road trip McQueen and road trip Mater and whatever. 
um, it's cool that they're mixing it up, though. We did get three uh, WGP McQueens, but some of the Mater and McQueen variations here were really cool. So, as we kind of finish the video here, I guess I'll share my top five minis um, here. And I think McQueen, from McQueens and Maters, these are my two favorite McQueen and Mater variations. I oh, really like President Mater. I think he may be my favorite uh, Mater variation of all time. Also, really like Suki. I said, really like Suki here. Uh, Jeff Gerbet, he's my favorite WGP racer, so kind of have to put him up here. I really do like him as well. And Chief does here, unique, has not been released yet. Um, he's a very unique casting too, so. These are my top five mini racers from the whole unboxing. My favorite, probably Suki, honestly, really like Suki um, as a mini racer, but I don't know. All these are very cool. Present Mater, again, like I said, my favorite Mater variation. So let me know what you guys think down in the comments below. Of all the ones, of all the mini racers I unboxed, which one is your favorite? Let me know down in the comments below. And have you picked up any of these three packs that I showed off? Uh, let me know down, that down in the comments below as well. Thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Hit the like button, subscribe, share, comment, all that good stuff. And I will see you all in the next video. Goodbye.